tourist traps can waste your time, money, and energy, turning what should be an amazing trip into a frustrating experience. From crowded landmarks to overpriced attractions, they're everywhere, and it's easy to fall into the trap. But don't worry, we're here to help you navigate around the worst of them. Whether you're planning your next big adventure or just curious about what to avoid, stick with us as we reveal some of the most disappointing spots and how to make the most of your travels instead. Number one, Times Square, New York City. Times Square is undeniably iconic with its flashing billboards and vibrant energy. But the reality is that it's packed with tourists, overpriced attractions, and aggressive street performers. The magic fades when you're jostling through crowds, and that perfect Instagram shot is marred by the sea of people. If you want a more authentic taste of New York, skip Times Square and head to places like Greenwich Village, where you can find charming streets, cozy cafes, and a much more local vibe. Off-Broadway shows are also a better cultural experience than anything on the Strip. Number two, the Leaning Tower of Pisa, Italy. The Leaning Tower of Pisa may be one of the most recognizable landmarks in Italy, but the area surrounding it is a tourist trap. Overpriced cafes, tacky souvenir stalls, and hordes of tourists trying to get the same forced perspective photo can make the experience underwhelming. Rather than spending hours in this congested area, consider exploring nearby Tuscan towns like Lucca or Volterra, where you'll find medieval charm, fewer tourists, and much more authentic Italian culture. Number three, the Hollywood sign, Los Angeles. While the Hollywood sign is an iconic symbol of Los Angeles, visiting it in person often disappoints. The best views are restricted by fences and the narrow roads leading to it are congested with traffic. If you're hoping for that perfect shot, you'll likely find yourself battling for space with crowds of tourists. Instead, Experience LA's film history by visiting the Griffith Observatory, where you'll enjoy panoramic views of the city and the sign in a more serene setting. Number four, Santorini, Greece. Santorini's whitewashed buildings and blue domes are postcard perfect but they also attract massive crowds, especially during peak season. What should be a peaceful escape becomes a battle for a spot to watch the sunset. Prices for everything, from food to accommodations, skyrocket, and the tiny streets become a sea of tourists. For a more tranquil Greek island experience, check out Naxos or Paros, where the scenery is just as beautiful, but the atmosphere is far more relaxed. Number five, the Champs-Élysées, Paris. Though famous for its luxury shops and historical significance, the Champs-Élysées is often overcrowded and overpriced. The charm fades as you walk through tourist-packed streets lined with commercialized stores. For a more authentic Parisian experience, Visit neighborhoods like Le Marais or Montmartre, where you'll find quaint boutiques, charming cafes, and a much more local vibe. Number six, Hate ashbury San Francisco. Once the heart of the 1960s counterculture, Hate ashbury today feels more like a tourist trap with overpriced vintage stores and street vendors. Instead, explore the nearby Mission District, where you'll find vibrant street art and some of the best tacos in the city, offering a much more authentic slice of San Francisco life. Number seven, Nihon, 
Copenhagen. Nihon, with its colorful houses lining the canal, looks idyllic in pictures, but is often overcrowded with tourists and overpriced restaurants. To experience Copenhagen like a local, venture to the meatpacking district, where trendy cafes, bars, and street food vendors serve up delicious local fare in a more relaxed and authentic atmosphere. Number eight. Iceland. Iceland, a land of fire and ice, might seem like the ultimate destination for dramatic landscapes. But despite its rising popularity, the crowds are catching up, especially at spots like the Blue Lagoon or the Golden Circle. Instead of following the typical tourist trail, venture to Iceland's rugged west fjords or the untouched highlands for more solitude. Explore black sand beaches geothermal wonders, and majestic fjords away from the influx of visitors. The quieter corners of Iceland are where the real magic lies, without the rush of tour buses. Number 9. Stonehenge, England. Stonehenge is undoubtedly an impressive sight, but you can only get so close, and the crowds often make the experience feel rushed and less magical. For a more personal encounter with ancient history, visit Avebury, another stone circle where you can actually walk among the stones, surrounded by a quiet village and countryside. Number 10. Thailand. While Thailand is famous for its vibrant culture and stunning temples, some popular spots like Phuket and Pattaya have become tourist hotspots packed with crowds and overdeveloped resorts. Instead of these overly commercialized areas, explore Thailand's lesser-known islands or northern regions. Places like Chiang Mai offer a more peaceful and authentic experience, with ancient temples, local markets, and lush mountainous landscapes. The quieter beaches of Koh Lanta or the cultural richness of Chiang Rai will leave you with a far more genuine Thai experience. Number 11. Pyramids of Giza, Egypt. The Pyramids of Giza are one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. But the experience is often marred by aggressive touts and overcrowding. If you want to explore Egypt's ancient history in peace, Consider visiting the pyramids of Dashur or Saqqara, where you can appreciate the country's rich past without the commercialization. Number 12. The Trevi Fountain, Rome. The Trevi Fountain is stunning, but the small square surrounding it is packed with tourists trying to snap the perfect photo. You'll spend more time fighting through crowds than admiring its beauty. Instead, take a quiet stroll around Villa Borghese Gardens or visit one of Rome's lesser-known piazzas to experience the city's charm without the chaos. Number 13. Venice, Italy. Venice's canals may be world-famous, but the crowds and tourist traps make it far less romantic than expected. Overpriced gondola rides and congested streets can turn your dream trip into a stressful ordeal. For a more peaceful experience, visit nearby islands like Burano or Torcello, where you can enjoy Venice's architecture and charm without the hustle. Number 14, Niagara Falls, USA, Canada. Niagara Falls is a breathtaking natural wonder but the surrounding area has become a hub of commercial tourism with souvenir shops, casinos, and overpriced restaurants. For a more peaceful experience, skip the main strip and explore the nearby hiking trails at Niagara Glen, where you can enjoy the beauty of the Niagara River without the crowds. Number 15, Mount Fuji, Japan. Mount Fuji is stunning from a distance, but the climb itself 
can be grueling and crowded during peak season. Many travelers opt to enjoy the view from nearby Lake Kawaguchi, where you can take in the majesty of Fuji while enjoying peaceful surroundings. Or visit Hakone, where hot springs and scenic trains offer a relaxing way to see the iconic mountain. And that wraps up our list of overrated tourist traps you might want to skip. While these spots may be famous, sometimes the most rewarding travel experiences come from exploring lesser-known places that offer a more authentic and relaxed atmosphere. So next time you're planning a trip, consider venturing off the beaten path. You might be surprised by what you discover. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more travel tips and insights.